Well, Paolo, a really successful night here at Medeci Stadium. Must be a very happy manager. Um, I am. I am satisfied with the result. Although I think that it wasn't easy at all. I think guys earned it. I think they worked hard. First half was a very, um, very even game. I think we conceded a couple of unnecessary opportunities to our opponent, which um, positively for us uh, shook us up, and we reacted. We reacted with a with a goal. Uh, in our favor, so th that was that was definitely a good um, moment uh, in the game, which um, went uh, in our direction. So now, in the second half, we had a we had a very very good start, and I think that uh, uh, basically decided the game. But you have to play against every team until the end, which they also pushed us and and did it very hard and difficult for us and. Uh, it wasn't easy at all, so I'm pleased with the performance, I'm pleased with the effort uh, of the guys. The spirit was great after coming back after a um, certain period of time that we haven't played a championship game. It was very good to see this performance and uh, now we move on, move on. Yeah, I mean, as you say, it was a, a tough game, Coventry, not a bad opponent by any stretch. And the, the scoreline, uh, as you say, is really good to see. But as a manager, you're always picking on those small moments, opportunities to improve. Yeah, definitely. I think there were moments in the game where we, we could have done better and uh, I'm always very grateful to our group that they always want to learn and they understand that uh, every coaching point and every corrections that we give after the game, after we an analyze, um, it's, um, it's for good. It's to, to help everyone improve and, and moving forward become a successful team in every single game. So that, that's going to be addressed when we when we have the, the next opportunity, when we think it's the appropriate and when the guys are ready and recovered and uh, mentally and emotionally also ready to, to receive the information. But that's, that's, um, that's a different thing. So now we just have to think about recovering them. I think it's, um, it's a very important uh, week and important games, important month for us. And this helps a lot. It's, yeah, in particular because, as you said, it's such a long time since we've had the opportunity to play for three points. So to get the to get the tally ticking over so soon, it's it's what you wanted. Yes, it's um, it was a very very good uh, very very good day for us. Very good game, very good test. Learn, prepare, recover, and next game. Absolutely, in the next game, yeah, away at uh, Preston. So yeah, it's uh, more of the same. It's this big busy period once again, isn't it? Yes, now we have to focus, as I said, and I always say, I know I'm repeating myself, but that's how it is. That's what we have to do. Um, recover uh, from, from this um, big effort we had today and uh, prepare ourselves for, for another tough game, for another opponent that in the past uh, beat us. And uh, now it's, it's our time to see if we are capable to, to put, a, again, another a uh, good performance and, and get a win. Uh, and just two small points on tonight's game. Three goals and three really high quality goals as well. That's, that's brilliant when you... Yeah, you brilliant, brilliant. I'm, I'm very pleased with the performance. Uh, attacking performance, defensive, clean sheet. A everything was there, everything except we couldn't celebrate uh, properly, but that's uh, how it is. And these times we have to know uh, what times are we are living. So that's uh, that's fine. We will, we will be... We'll be ready for the next game. And very last one, Andy Rinomotta, it's his 100th game for Reading tonight and he scored as well. Very happy but, for him. But what a great landmark that is, he's become a, such a crucial player. Very happy for him, it was um, very nice to see him scoring and celebrating the way he did. So, you know, everyone, you can see that uh, Andy is a um, uh, team favourite, one of the team favourite players uh, that we have in our changing room and uh, everyone was so, so excited with his fantastic finish.